after spray painting a little bit, I'm out here getting this sun gaze on. And, uh, you know, people say sunrise and sunset, but the sun is the most powerful at noon or after one. And that is what has been written in our false fake history to be called the most high God from Egyptian times, which is not as countable more than one set of three pyramids in fucking goddamn Giza before the zero year. <laughs> doesn't it doesn't hold itself accountable for an entire Egyptian history, but uh well <laughs> So I take the little hints and the clues and I put them together and I find the ultimate truth. And you don't have to understand this or take it for what it's worth or take it at face value. Just try the experiment for yourself. You'll see that you never go blind when you stare at the sun. There's no right or wrong time to look at it. You just build yourself up to the most powerful times to look at it and get the most electromagnetism that you're, you know, that the sun has to offer you. It's like closer to you. Um, a lot of people that are in higher uh, altitudes, like in the Orient, they actually experience a lot of levitation and in that crouching tiger stuff that you see in the movies, they can actually do. And at these high uh, altitudes, uh, most normal, typical men would fall to their deaths, but these people can actually levitate from one place to another. It's extremely dangerous at these, these high altitudes. A lot of... Uh, I've just been studying a lot of accounts of people who've seen different things and they hike and voyage in different regions of the earth. So, you know, I always got my eyes open to, you know, learn more knowledge. But, uh, yeah, I'm sun gazing, absorbing, absorbing the energy from the sun, and I'm also absorbing energy from the earth. And this is the northern light energy, less concentrated in small remnants. I will absorb these. My sandals are giving off eddy currents which, uh, you know, you combine a powerful magnet with copper and it creates, it creates eddy currents. And if your skin is up against the copper, you get the current straight to your crown chakra and you can feel it all over your body. It's a nice regiment to include. <sighs> oh, so many ideas flow when one looks in the sun. Just really get your brain going. And I'll feel my chakra alignment start to charge up going up to my back into my crown chakra right now I can feel it in my crown it's absolutely amazing people should try this and you try to get up to the highest sun and you try to stare into it as long as possible because you get the most benefits the more you're connected to it so yeah check out crouching tiger check out chi masters they're only absorbing energy from the aurora borealis that comes out of the earth in small remnants stay awake